Okay, movie review of Insidious 3. Now, uh, I barely remember half the movie because uh, I haven't watched it like in uh, weeks or so. I don't remember. But I guess it was okay of a movie. I bought this like at, uh, what is it? Oh yeah, it's a tray post. Yeah. And it was kind of okay, but, uh, <laughs> I would say the animation is okay. Hmm. Though, it would, it needs a little bit of work. Work for it. Uh, the monster was pretty scary. We were scared in the one and two, I guess. Mm, uh, yeah, it was. We were scared in the one and two. Um. Mostly pretty good movie overall. Uh, the, uh, grandma, I think she was, uh, a, a little bit, which, I, the, uh, grandma was a little bit, uh, a little bit, uh, bad casting, I think, acting, I don't remember who acted there. Who acted the grandma, I don't know. I don't want to look. Uh... Bad, I think she bad. She did act very well, but uh, I'm just saying that it's that she all her scenes are kind of slow a bit, uh, except for the one with the uh, except for the one when she's trying to take down the uh, the uh, monster. That one's kind of fast and stuff, and, uh, but, uh, she doesn't much, I really didn't like that she wasn't much of a fire. Because in the first, because in the second one, she was, had a lot of suspension and stuff. Or in the second one, yeah, she was in a, had a bunch of suspense and, uh, in it when they went and traveled back. So I think that's all I can think of, because really, I haven't watched this in a week or two, so that's kind of why. If I did watch it again, I would probably give a good or good review than this. Which... I'm probably, if I ever did watch it again, I would probably still not review it. That's all I got for it. And I think that's it. Peace.